One of the reasons I really preface doing high-intensity work is the lactate production, because we're finding more and more research coming out showing that part of the development of dementia and Alzheimer and the plaque is a misstep in brain metabolism. So when we're looking at brain metabolism and the brain uses a lot of glucose, it also uses lactate. Now for women, we have less of the glycolytic or lactate producing fibers, and we tend to lose those with age. Men are born with more, tend to hold on to them more, so it's not necessarily as big an issue for lactate production. Men need to spend more time in the low intensity being able to produce more of our fat burning capacity. But for women doing that high intensity work and being able to produce lactate to then allow the heart and the brain to use that preferential fuel feeds forward to reducing the misstep in this brain metabolism component that occurs. And it's such a sex difference. We're seeing a, a change in glucose metabolism in and around perimenopause into menopause. So it's that lactate production that is kind of the offshoot of the high intensity work that's super important for brain health.